we have this video, it's like in uh, China, it could be Malaysian Chinese, and they've got a guy laying down, it's like a sort of some sort of dare, and that they're not carnivorous maggots. Someone asked me, are these maggots going to eat his chest away? No, they're, they look like mealworms, which are a uh, actually a vegan vegetarian sort of worm, so they won't pose any health threat to this young lad. He looks like a bit more of a little prank or a little dare or something like that. But <laughs> these little worms, totally harmless, not a problem at all, and uh, totally safe. Let's hope he puts the worms back in the garden afterwards. You can relax. The guy's not going to get eaten by the carnivorous maggots, the flesh-eating worms. It's just a little, uh, it's just a little fun thing they're doing. It's like, a, what's the word? That's it. Who dares wins or whatever. So those mealworms, actually, if you're on the paleo or primal diet, those mealworms should be making up part of your diet because they're not domesticated. They're from the sawfly family, so which is a, like a prehistoric thing. So definitely. In paleo primal days, if you buy into that sort of fad diet theory, then the insects are part of your dietary makeup. Well, that should be because if you're eating domesticated animals like cows and chickens, which I'm sorry, but they were not around back in the paleo primal fad diet days. So if you're following the paleo primal diet, then please, you should be licking these little maggots off this guy's chest. Just saying.